Hey, welcome back to Triple R. Today we got a Dollar Tree haul for Wonder Woman. So, a couple like poster things and crayons, stickers. Let's check it out. All right, welcome back to Triple R. Today we found some Wonder Woman 84 stuff at the Dollar Tree. I uh, haven't seen the movie. I've heard horrible reviews, heard it's terrible, so I haven't even bothered. Um, good thing is the art is more along the lines of I'd say the 80s Wonder Woman, which is a good thing as far as like this stuff right here. Um, I mean, you can see the Gal Gadot influence and I do like Gal Gadot as Wonder Woman. Um, when they first picked her, I thought it was a terrible pick. When I watched the first movie and um, was impressed, so she is a good Wonder Woman. Um, I do think Cheetah was kind of bad. So I haven't seen this movie, but from what I've seen, it's not great. Um, this picture, Looks like uh, Olivia Munn to me, which some would say would make a good Wonder Woman. So some stickers right there for a dollar. And then yeah, this pack of 84 crayons. Again, I like the art of this cartoon style versus just the movie like screenshots. So I really like to actually put the art in here and it looks good. So that's a good um, Wonder Woman uniform. I like that one more than some of the other ones. Especially that one where they put like the pants and jacket on her for a little while. That was really dumb, but these look pretty good. So a few pack of eight, about 24 crowns for a buck. And I'm not sure if there's anything on the back or not. Probably just the same, same picture. We'll see, maybe. And then we have so this was like near the checkout. So I was like, well, I'm grabbing all this other stuff. I might as well just grab this too. So I haven't really looked in here. So let's see. Okay, so we got more of the same type, a little bit bigger. Like save the day sticker. And then some more. So if you're a fan, I'll about pick up for a dollar, I think. And I think they're all kind of the same poses, but different types of stickers, like this puffy. And you have like this you know, glitter dust on that one. And you have the metallic on here. And then you have your standard. And I think that's it. Yeah, it's not bad, 150 stickers. I said a lot more of the same though. But. And then what really caught my eye initially was this thing. Which again is 84, but has a more standard Wonder Woman look to me. Uh, the armor is of course from the movie. So I don't like how it says four of art posters set. I mean, it's one big poster and then these down here. Well. These, these three little ones, not much of a poster, I'd say. Uh, I think I do like that they uh, put the skin color in, since it can be hard to do in markers and stuff, and that way you have your pack of markers here. I did do a dinosaur one of these before, and uh, could have been the way I was doing it, but the markers ran out before I got the picture completely finished. So, but got most of it, so uh, if you're more conservative, it, conservative of your coloring I guess you probably could get it all done make it look how you want or just get your own set of markers and do however you want so this is the Dollar Tree Wonder Woman haul it's many stickers and crayons focus this a little bit better and then this poster which I probably will actually try to color in at some point in time uh, to me the art is the best on these. This is the best looking of the haul. This looks more like a comic book. And then you have like some movie. Really, this is the only thing movie. Like cinematic universe for DC, as you see. Just fine. Uh, I use that same pose on each one. So I like Wonder Woman stuff, even though it's 84, that's still. A pretty good looking Wonder Woman set of stuff. Well, thanks for watching Triple R. Have a good day or night, wherever you are.